David Oliver with Mike's Bike. For those of you that are going to be doing the Canary Challenge this year, uh, we just did a descent down Highway 84. So what we like to do is talk a little bit about the descent and how to corner. When you're cornering, you want to apex the turn, meaning you want to start from the outside, go to the inside at the middle of the turn, and exit at the outside of the turn again. It carries the best speed. It's the most efficient way to corner. The other thing you'd like to do, and if it's a right-hand turn, you want to make sure your right leg is up and your left leg is down and weighted. Another thing to keep in mind is that you want to look and see if there's any cars behind you. You're going to look over your left shoulder. Feel free to take up as much of the lane as you need to. You have every right to be on that road. You don't need to crowd yourself over to the edge. If you need to pick up the whole lane, feel free to pick up the whole lane. Another thing too is always look ahead. See what's ahead of you. Know that when you're exiting the turn that it, you, it is safe for you to exit. Another thing that you want to do is point out obstacles that are in the road. Yeah, so if you're riding along and there is a obstruction in the road on the right hand side, you want to alert the riders behind you that there's something in the road and you're going to use your right hand to point at whatever is in the road so that they know to avoid that area. Another thing that's a big key when you're out there climbing is to also layer and dress appropriately. I believe you guys are going to be doing this around the September time frame. So, if you're up on top of the skyline area, it could be foggy, it could be cloudy, it could even be a little bit windy. So what I like to do is dress in layers like I have now. These are arm warmers, these are knee warmers. So, when you get to the top and you're about ready to descend and you have your stuff on and you get to the bottom, now after you're at the bottom and you're ready to climb again, you can simply take this stuff right off you just reach up, grab your arm warmers, peel them straight out, you can bunch them up, put them in your jersey pocket, and then you're ready to start climbing again and you won't overheat.